The emotional response to the deadly Texas mall shooting from the 2020 campaign trail. Democrats in Nevada tonight weighing in, the moment drawing a particularly powerful response from former Congressman Beto O'Rourke. El Paso is his hometown. Here's ABC's Rachel Scott. I've got to share something with you that, that I just learned. Former Congressman Beto O'Rourke sharing the news with the crowd in Las Vegas. Another mass shooting in America, this time in his hometown. I'm thinking about El Paso. I want you to be thinking about El Paso as well. Warg saying he checked in on his wife and kids before taking the stage with a rallying cry for gun control. You know, any illusion that we had that um, progress is inevitable or the, the change that we need is going to come of its own accord, shattered in, in moments like these, uh, and, and that is upon every single one of us. There, there is no luxury in this democracy. Uh, of sitting this one out. The congressman then cutting short his trip to Nevada. Other candidates weighing in too, including another Texan in the race, former Housing and Urban Development Secretary Julian Castro, calling the shooting devastating. Senator Elizabeth Warren declaring, we must act now to end our country's gun violence epidemic. This is a very personal issue for me because every day we wait, more people are dying all around America, roughly 100 a day. And so enough is enough. I put out the boldest plan because I'm determined not to let the NRA or the corporate gun lobby dictate this debate. It is time long overdue for the United States Senate to begin to do what the American people want, and that is pass common sense gun safety legislation. And there will be a forum on gun control right here in Las Vegas later this fall as this city marks the second anniversary of the Las Vegas mass shooting. All the Democratic candidates are invited to attend, and Congressman Beto O'Rourke's campaign tells us he plans to be there. Tom? Rachel Scott with reaction to the mass shooting from the campaign trail. Rachel, thanks to you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.